All right, in this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to properly set up the particle system so that the particles from one emitter can interact with the particles from another emitter. As you can see here, the particles are just moving through each other. But in a case like this where I want one emitter to create blue particles and I want another one to emit red particles, they need to be two different particle systems. And what I mean by particle systems is it needs to have like you can see the blue one, it's its particle system right here. It's named blue particle system. And then the red one is named red particle system. They're two separate systems. But how do you get those to interact? Well, it's actually pretty simple. You go down here to fluid interaction. And then right now I have the red particle system selected. So I need to add the blue particle system to this so that it knows to interact with the blue particle system. So I click, click plus and then right here I find the blue emitter. And the blue emitter is the one that has the blue particle system. Now I go over to the blue emitter and then I add the red emitter to it. It's really that simple. Now, as you can see, whenever the particles hit each other, they actually react like they're supposed to. I hope you found that helpful. If you have any questions, let me know and I will try to explain it. Thanks for watching. Later, people.